Hey everyone, Tamias here, and welcome to another Honkai Star Rail video. What the? <laughs> Yo! What is this? A free limited 5 star? Dr. Ratio is completely free. I, I cannot, I just cannot believe it. Now, Honkai Star Rail has won the Games Awards 2023 for Best Mobile Game and iPhone's Game of the Year 2023, as well as Google Play's Best of 2023. And to reward all of the players and the support they're getting, we are getting Dr. L, no, rather Dr. W plus Ratio for completely free. The imaginary hunt type character is now free. I, I can't, I can't believe it. He's gonna be free. Look at this, it's no longer L here okay it's no longer l plus ratio it's it's com completely w it's a total win so um of course thank you pride win for sharing this news and to message me in our the group chat and uh not only do we get this completely free there's also three different codes well I'll, I'll paste in the uh, description down below so you can just copy and paste and redeem those uh stellar jades but still, oh my god, Dr. Ratio is completely free. And of course, we also have more news with uh, Rumi. Oh my gosh, she looks so damn good. So let's take a look at the, what they have in store for us. I will just restart the music, of course, in the back. Give me one second. Here we go. And we are back so if you missed the live stream you can go check it out here but uh, a lot of things have re uh, have been reviewed but most importantly Rame's banner in 1.6 is gonna be insane because not only do we get Rame, i believe uh shui yi is also on the banner as well let me see if they yeah here goes shui yi is on Rame's banner so previously the new unit sometimes uh, most of the time falls under the second new character banner so for example um hang ya was on argenti but no it's gonna be uh, Rame with Shui Yi. So this banner is top tier all waifus. Absolutely all waifus. It's going to be insane. So let's take a look at the skills because they do reveal it and uh, it, it looks really good, right? So I'll mute this, but you can see some of the artwork and the skill animations. And I can't wait to create the legs for days team. Rame with Kafka and um, uh, Black Swan. And of course, Kafka is getting a rerun as well. So look at this animation. Oh my god. Legs for days. Days. look at that absolutely beautiful so what does it do really so we can take a look at uh, the skill description so now um basic is ice type damage and skill uh, after using her skill weakness break efficiency for alice increases i'm gonna uh, say so this is again really good for break type uh and quote unquote dot teams um for example kafka and the black swan later on hopefully for nihility uh and the ultimate deploys a field that lasts for a certain amount of turns and all type resist pen increases and when they break in weakness they apply mark to the enemy and the mark um is triggered and uh when they attempt to recover their weakness break and the duration of the weakness break extends and delays the oh my god this is gonna be so insane and also increases the speed of allies as a tell Honestly, once we get the full description and the full skills, I think she's going to be quite core. We're looking at top tier waifu dot damage. Like I said, teams, legs for days with Rame, Kafka, and Black Swan. That is 100% the team I'm going to try to build. And um, yeah, we'll have to see all the skill um, information when it does come out. Now, Dr. Ratio, again, going to be completely free. Imagine type hunt character. Okay, so combat roll and um, deals imaginary single damage, uh, single type damage to the enemy, and deals uh, applies Wiseman's Folly. So when attacks and target afflicted by the Wiseman's Folly launches a follow attack. Okay, so the ultimate applies a follow up damage debuff, uh, in the sense that every time you hit an enemy that has this debuff, the Wiseman's Folly's debuff, you attack again. Oh my God, it's crazy! And the talent is. Um, after using the skill, 40% chance of launching a follow-up. So this is, okay, like I've said previously, right? We're really looking into um, building teams that have synergies across the two cores. Previously, we're running one single core, two supports, and one sustain. But now we're slowly, I think, moving into a solo sustain that buffs the team, right? And then two cores and one support. The two cores, one is going to be a sub DPS that can buff the type of play style the team is playing at. And the other is actually a, a support. So... For example, when Kafka uh, was released, it's not a lot of dot damage options, definitely not a 5-star option, but now you will have two cores looking at Kafka plus, for example, 
or hopefully black swan and then uh, a support in the sense of run mate and a solo sustainer whichever you choose so there's the dot there's the follow-up with the jing run and topaz and we may look at uh, some other potential potential teams um, there's an hp manipulation with um uh, jing Liu and uh blade but jing Liu is so honestly so broken that you just want hyper carry jing Liu. and let's take a look at shui Yi. another quantum oh my god we just got released sparkle right or hanabi and she's gonna be a quantum harmony play uh unit so this another quantum man quantum is eating so good so what type is this uh this is a destruction quantum destruction um, strongly focus on the pleading toughness. Okay, so deals quantum damage uh, with the skill also deals single target damage and to adjacent allies. And um, ultimate deals damage to a single target and ignores weakness types and reduce stuff. Wow. So this is com regardless of the enemy weakness type, you are going to. Okay, I think once the skills are out, we actually need to take a deeper dive into all the units because this. These units are looking really, really interesting. Okay, I think now it's time to open a lot of the uh, different mechanics and gameplay styles with the introduction of Mach 12 as well as uh, Pure Fiction. It's going to be definitely very, very sweet to see all the different uh, testing results. So, as we said, the Runmei banner has Xue Yi and the uh, Dr. L plus ratio or <laughs> has a uh, awkward four stars but you know what most people will not pull for him because he is completely free oh my god oh my god look at this code this like go oh 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 lord oh oh my god and of course blade and kafka rerun during the patch and new main story finally we are heading into a new chapter so simulated universe gold okay so i think the new events and all the new game modes will definitely take a deeper dive uh in a separate video but most importantly uh, I want to talk about Pure Fiction. So this is the endless wave game mode they talked about, right? So this is going to be extremely, extremely interesting to see how it's going to bring um, a content into our end game because we, so far we have Memory Chaos, but now we also have Memory Chaos 11 and 12. So we, we have to see. We have to see how crazy this is. And we know the schedule. It's um, on a six-week uh, rotation and there's overlap. So there are two weeks in which you can do two Memories of Chaos and uh, one Pure Fiction all at the same time if you really need to rush everything but seriously a free doctor ratio is honestly insane of course we also have a 2.0 teaser which we talked about and new characters that will appear robin misha okay you know what this this oh my god this is the 2.0 characters okay we'll do another video on this where i take a deeper look into all of these two point this is huge news this is honestly huge news look at these top tier units misha miss adventurine miss robin black swan arc Oh my god, this is honestly crazy. I can't wait, I can't wait. Great things ahead for Honka Star. And of course, here are the codes available to redeem. So 300 gems. And um, yeah, let me know if you're excited about this. I'm super, super pumped. And thank you, Honka Star, for giving us all of these free goodies. Uh, so many things to digest. Uh, stay tuned for upcoming videos because we have so many more to cover for Honka Star. I feel like 1.6 into 2.0 is going to be the biggest update the game has seen. So yes, I'm honestly super, super pumped. Anyhow, it's Tomias here, and I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye now.